When are you coming over to do some solo shows? Uh, when, once the whole album's out, I'll probably come back and do it. So tour. sometime next year? Yeah. Let me ask you about performing at the Oscars, because that was amazing. I was watching the Oscars go out, and you, you opened that with Queen, uh, and I thought, God, that must be a nerve-wracking gig. Wow. I mean, when they called me and, and, and asked me to do it, I, oh, yes, obviously, hung up, and what am I going to wear? And then I started <laughs> thinking about, oh, my God, the Oscars. Yeah. I mean, it's Los Angeles' biggest night. And also, a global TV audience is one of the biggest shows in the world. I mean, it's it's watched by billions, isn't it? And so I had to kind of talk myself down, you know, and kind of say to myself, okay, we've performed this together dozens of times. Let's just go out there and look at the lights and not look at the audience. Yeah, yeah. So and I'm then just... at the end, I looked at the audience. <laughs> and and who, who seemed to be enjoying it the most, do you think, when you looked out at the famous faces? I don't know. I, I saw a couple people when I looked out there. I saw Queen Latifah, who was having a great time. Of course, the Queen. Um, Gaga and Rami were in the very front. I saw Glenn Close was really getting into oh, yeah. it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was such a beautiful night. I uh, loved it. You weren't a fan of that performance, were you, Mel? Oh, I heard about this. Yeah. <laughs> I heard about this. Why well, she, are you she bringing always that speaks up? her mind. You always speak no, her why mind. Why are you bringing that up right now? Thought... Adam, you know I love you. It, yeah. I was not offended. What did you say? Uh, do you want to remind me what I said? Because I'm sure I'm going to kerfuffle my words. <laughs> I think you said you wanted to be more pizzazz. Yeah, more bigger pizzazzy. and better because he's fabulous. But you Have know you ever what? Seen him perform? I agree Live. with you because it did, feel like, it did feel like the setting and the staging didn't do you justice. I thought, I thought you were great. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. You were great, and the but band was great. But I've given you more of a well, kind listen, of forum to Maybe some fireworks with. or something. Fireworks. Yeah. Yes, maybe this some this explains why I got an, an I, I love you text out of nowhere. I got a, like a random Mel B, I love oh, you I text. See. And I was like, what's that about? And then I heard after the fact, yeah. oh, she slagged off your performance. I was like, oh. No, no, your hold performance, the, what the, they did around so your Mel, performance. So Mel, hold it. When you, when you know you've said something, and you're a very honest woman, I know, so you're saying yeah. what's on but when you've spoken like that, do you immediately think, uh, you leave us you and think, okay, Apology text. Well, no, ap apology text, but I want to put it in context because the press can take it out of context. <laughs> yes, yes. And it wasn't Adam's performance, no. let's get that right. It was you didn't, like, you didn't like Brian's. I didn't like what they did around, <laughs> <laughs> around him. <laughs> Shut up, move on. Who? <laughs>